So about three years ago, I was in the studio and I was writing and I thought I'll write a birthday song, a New Year's song, a Christmas song. Then we wrote this song called Bad Sharon and I enjoyed it so much. I was like, this is so much fun. I want to do a whole album yeah. of this. So it's taken three years. I love a Christmas song. I love a Christmas album. What are your favourites? Uh, my favourite Christmas song of all time is Fairy Tale of New York. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, but, but you do some covers on the album, but you don't cover that one. Uh, no, because I, I wanted the only person that I wanted to do that with was Britney Spears. And. Uh, <laughs> but you're and, a fan of hers, obviously. She's yeah, a good I love Britney yeah, Spears. Yeah, yeah. But I, I think it would have been sacrilegious to cover that song anyway, because it's so brilliant. But if I was going to do it with anybody, I'd want to do it with Britney Spears. Yeah. And I, I did want to do it with Britney Spears all the way through the 90s, never got around to it. And so what did. <laughs> One of the few that escaped you. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but there are other collaborations on the album. Uh, Rod Stewart, who yeah. I know you've known for a while, of course. Yeah. Jamie Callum also. But here's the one that surprised me. You mentioned the song you do with him, Bad Sharon. Tyson Fury. Yeah. The boxer Tyson Fury. The now, Gypsy King. I yeah. wouldn't have thought that was a, you know, the first person you could have. How did you discover that, A, he could sing, but you wanted to work with him? Well, I do this residency in Vegas, and um, I was out there doing that, and he had a fight on at uh, another hotel, and I went over to see him. And he invited me into his dressing room before the fight, which I thought was absolutely amazing. I was yeah. kind of like, are you, you sure you, you're taking visitors? But, like, Gordon Ramsay was in there before me and a few other people. And I went in and it just struck me. I, I'd seen him sing, uh, I don't want to close your eyes, I don't want to fall asleep, after one of his bouts. And I was like, he can sing. He should be on my Christmas album. He said yes. And, uh, and then he followed through with it. And... I love him a bit. He's, uh, he's a massive character, huge personality. And actually, the news of that particular song travelled more than anything else travelled. You don't box, though, yourself, do you? I do box, yeah. You do box? Yeah. You any good? Uh, oh, I'm yeah, because bad. you've been hoping to get a fight with Liam Gallagher. Yeah. Now... <laughs> <laughs> I mean, well, I should, maybe should rephrase that, because you want to you wanna box him in the ring... Yeah. Is this a genuine offer, a genuine challenge that you're putting out there? Yeah, absolutely. You know, I've, I've got to inhabit various different things throughout my career. Like with Soccer Aid, I, I get to pretend to be a footballer. And when I'm on stage, I get to pretend I'm a singer. And, you know, I, I just want to experience lots of different things. And I've been boxing and I love it. And if there's anybody that I want to box, it's Liam Gallagher. Okay, so that, right. Could that we would ask you why? What's the we? Is there kind of a because you could box your new friend Tyson Fury if you wanted? I imagine. Yeah, no, I'm. I, I want someone I can beat. <laughs> <laughs> but is there beef between you and Liam? Is it because I well, can imagine there was in the nineties. Yes, yeah. but but you were friends for a while as well, weren't you? Well, we hung out in the same sort of circles. I wouldn't necessarily say that we were right. friends. But, you know, if there's... Uh, there we are. <laughs> 1995. Plus I mean, you... he's, he's actually gently cupping my balls there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, and so you've offered this, but he hasn't responded, or has he just said no? What, what's the, do you know the what? He hasn't way? responded twice. Uh, uh. And I'd really like to do it. I've spoken to Eddie Hearn. Eddie Hearn's up for it. So you do... And he's a promoter, on the Eddie Hearn. Yeah. Is this a big... So you do it for, as a charity event, would you? No. OK. No. <laughs> Well, that's the Christmas spirit right there. Yeah. <laughs>